I saw the uh, the, the tweets that were going on earlier uh, in the week. Um, you were getting tagged because uh, who was it? They uh, uh, Corey Lita. Graves referred to Lita as yes. the queen of extreme. So of course you get popped like crazy uh, in every tweet. Yeah, I mean they they've. They've called her Queen of Extreme before. They've, uh, I Liv Morgan, we talked about the Queen of Extreme. Liv Morgan used, tried to use the two. And, uh, you know, I, I trademarked that, I don't know, it's been maybe six months to close to a year now that I'm waiting for, because it takes some time to go through. You can't just do it and then tomorrow you have it done. Like it's, it, oh it, yeah, it's a it, process. Yeah, it's a big process. It takes time, and I mean, I've been using it now. It's over twenty five years, going on thirty years. So, I mean, the only thing I said was that because um, I, I appreciate the love. Please don't don't get me wrong, but so many people were just like, "Hey, did you hear Corey Graves said this?" And "Hey, did you?" And I'm just like, "Okay, first of all." I'm never mad at, like, I wouldn't be mad at Amy or Lita. I wouldn't be mad at her. Um, you know, she, she's not going around saying it, signing her name. Oh, well, maybe she is. I don't know. <laughs> not that I know of. Um, but my concern over this whole thing is I don't want them to try and trademark it and then tell me you can't use it anymore. Right. Because I've been using it for almost three decades. Right. And that's what like some people don't understand. Like one guy was like, "Oh, get over it! You're not relevant anymore. You pass the torch or whatever." He's and I was just like, "That's not the point. It's not yeah, pass the torch. It's not going to be deleted for the love of God." <laughs> she doesn't need the torch past her. She's she a superstar. <laughs> she she she's she's a star in herself. She doesn't need me to help her. My my thing is what people don't understand is when you establish a character and a gimmick and a name and you use that for years and years and years and years you don't pass that name on to somebody you know it's not like i'm i'm doing every indie show that i can working ringside you know at 51 years old saying i can hang with the younger no, that's not what I'm trying to do. Like, I'm just trying to hold on to my legacy in this business. And that is the name that I have used. That is the name that people know me by. So why would I just give it away and let right. other people use it? And pe people don't understand. Oh, it's a new generation. You should pass the torch. I, it's not that I don't want to pass the torch or share knowledge or, you know, uh, Tell tell other girls that that you know they're superstars. They're shining now, and and I you know I know my time in the ring is over now. If I'm used for anything, I'm not trying to make that big comeback. I've said this a million times. It's just like oh, it's ECW. It's a novelty. It's nostalgia. We want to see them, just like the arena this this past December. You don't see me in the ring every weekend. That's not my no. deal. That's not what I'm trying to do. What I will fight for is that name because I've worked hard and I've used it for so many years. So I finally said, okay, we're going to do a trademark on it. And, uh, you know, Stephen P. New was nice enough to put the trademark in for me. And now we are waiting to make it finalized. So for every, and, and I didn't get a lot of hate on it. I got a lot of positivity, but I just hope that people aren't, looking at me saying oh my god get over it you're so old or your time is past and it's not about so me trying to stay relevant or it, it's just about what i've worked hard for and i i feel like i've earned that name and i've used it for so long it would be weird if i can't use it anymore right and for them to take it away from me because they can't take my name um, I said this before, like in my contract, when I worked there, it was borrowed because it's my birth name. So they can't tell me not to use that name because I was born with it. Right. Which I got lucky with that. I kept the, the, that they didn't change a gimmick on me. Um, but for them to turn around and say, well, you can't be known as the queen of extreme anymore. That would be horrible. Yeah. So I'm shocked they didn't try to go after it already. I, I don't know whether I'm in this business another day or another 30 years from now. Like if I do conventions, I'm going to sign the queen of extreme Francine. I'm going to get that trademark. And if they continue to use it, we're going to file a cease and desist. And that's it. 
because they would do it to me. They would. If you get the trademark, can I have a, a, a signed picture that has the TM on it? <laughs> oh, do it? I have to write TM now? No, you don't. But I would love one that just has it. Just in the sure. it's just Queen of Extreme says TM. No, but it's not me being bitter or, or you know trying to be a jerk about things. It's I'm trying to you know protect my brand and protect what I worked hard for. And you know maybe I'm not doing a lot now, but that's my decision. This is my choice. I'm not busy every weekend, and that is by choice. I do get a lot of offers. I can be on the road every weekend if I want it to be. I mm -hmm. cannot because of my family. I can't. I physically can't do it, you know? So the little bit that I do, I'm going to protect it. Right. <coughs> Excuse me. So I'm not calling the girls out. I'm calling the company out. And I'm saying, listen, that's not your name to use. That's my name. And if you think, yeah, I'm I mean, wrong, it's, I'm it's one thing they pass it out to, they said it once for Liv Morgan and say now for Lita, you know, they, they said it, uh, then oh, they, Stephanie McMahon, was Stephanie using McMahon. Yeah, they, I mean, it was just like, come on, yeah, you know, and people tinkered around with it and, and it didn't stick. And with me, it stuck. And Paul's like, it's you, it works. It's you. You're using that. I was like, perfect. And I love it. I absolutely love that. And if they took that away from me and I couldn't use it anymore, I would be devastated yeah. because that's who I am. That's my character. You can't, you can't, after 30 years, you can't take that from a person, you know? I don't know. That's just, that's the way I feel about it. I don't know if anybody else feels that way. I got a little bit of trolling, not a lot. Not Actually, I think it was just one guy and I blocked him because I was just like, get out of here. I didn't even answer him. I just pushed the block button. Um, but like everybody else just was just like, yeah, that's you. When we hear that, we think of you. And I don't know. You know? Yeah. Uh, but that's, you know, it's funny. It's just that was the timing of Gangrel, the trademark. And you were talking about it the other day. And it's funny. They let some lapse, but that's one that they never. I'm, I'm shocked that they did not go after something like that years ago. So it's, mm -hmm. uh, it's funny that they, that they, they took, there's, there's certain things they took their eye off the prize years ago. Uh, it's, well, it's, I'm not in their it's, radar. I'm not on their radar. They, they couldn't care less about me. So maybe they think that I won't care, you know, because I'm kind of like not out there anymore, but guess what? <laughs> I care. And, and it's filed and, you know, when we when we went to look, it was available, and I was just like, "Ah, it's mine. <laughs> Get out of here." <laughs> so I was lucky. Yeah, but you Very know that young up and comer, uh, Lita. You know, she's... she's doing great things, though. Why are you knocking her? She's doing no, I'm not. No, it's just funny. Like she needs another moniker. You know, <laughs> yeah, right, right, right. No, <laughs> like no, we need I... to add another dimension to the Lita character. I never said anything negative about. No, her. no, no. Tweet. Like, I don't, I don't bury people. I build people up. But this, this subject is important to me because it's my legacy. It's something that I built and I've been using. And to, you know, it's like, okay, I'm going to call myself, uh, I don't know. What was the thing with the living legend and uh, Larry and yeah, and uh, well, Jericho uh, and that was a whole, uh, and there, there was a, a uh what was that that was in the book he was um oh gosh that's that's digging into the memory bank i know i remember what you're talking about i just i'm drawing a blank yeah, it's, it's hard yes. because um you know just establish your own stuff like do your own thing don't ugh, don't bite off of other people i mean you know when people do each other's moves in the ring people get hot uh, you can't i, I don't I don't know, man. I, I just feel like moves are different than a name. Mm -hmm. A name is a hundred percent different than like people stealing a move or changing. If you ask the person, like if I came up to you and said, Hey, Chad, you know, I know you do, uh, you know, a DDT, but if I called it this and I put a little swing on, like, I, I don't see anything wrong with stuff like that. Like, you know, changing it around and making it your own. Because there's not really, how innovative can you be 
coming up with moves is a hard it's hard because there you know there's only so much you could do to another person but when you're taking a person's name uh-huh. that's like i i don't i don't know i don't like that i, I mean like they could have they could have used verbiage like channeling her inner queen of extreme like francine from ecw like they could, pull me over <laughs> no but i'm saying they could have they that's what they could if they were going to use that name that's where they could have said that but well, obviously never. you know and, and Corey graves he's an old school dude i mean he probably if he, anybody would have it would have been him but he's going off of everything that's said in his earpiece absolutely he's so, told what to say and i and right. i get it but i feel like even when i was there i told you this when i was getting ready to walk to the ring I heard them say, don't call her the queen of extreme. We have Queen Charmel. Yeah. And I was just like, get <laughs> out of here. That's confusing. <laughs> I, that, I, like, I can't, I, you know, I don't understand. <laughs> I, don't, I don't get it. But uh, I'll be damned if I don't write that on my 8 by 10s Because uh, I better. always, and people always ask me to write that on my 8 by 10s So why should I stop now? I'm not going to. So it's trademarked. And it's go. It's through legal. It's going through, and hopefully, it will be done soon. And they won't be able to do it anymore. Very and nice. it's not me being petty. It's just no. me protecting my gimmick. business. Yeah, B- business, bitch. Get after it. <laughs>